So we're sitting here today uh, with Stephen Amick, who is uh, Director of Instruction at Glen Eagles Country Club here in Dallas. And Stephen and I have worked together on the Bunker Pro, but it has such a great story, and I've asked Stephen to kind of hang with me here and uh, kind of fill us in on that story. So tell me about the Bunker Pro, because I know how it got started with me. Well, Sam, I started with just making a prototype because I was so frustrated that I couldn't find a device that helped my students get out of the bunker effectively. Right. And the prototype that I made really was just some cardboard with some duct tape, wire attached to it, and then a plastic ball that I then taped to the wire. And when I played around with it enough, I actually found that it was very effective for helping my students get out of the bunker. And that's when I obviously sent the pictures to you. Yep. And from there, we made a couple different iterations yep. and finally came up with the Bunker Pro and it seems to be just really well received and a great device. It's been terrific and I, I think all great products start with some form of duct tape and usually a little cardboard. There's always wire in there someplace. Right. So when I got it I thought I feel right at home with this. This yeah. is perfect. Yeah. So I kind of started fiddling around with it with plastic and different things to get the right shape. But I have to tell you when we first started I thought I don't know this is kind of unique and then you said something to me that really struck a nerve. You just said, you just swing, miss the board, hit the sand. Yes. And so as I was talking to our staff about it, I said, it's pretty cool because you just miss the board, hit the sand. And uh, in fact, Cody and I came down to visit you. I remember it was cold, so it must have been in January or December yeah, or something. Yeah. Remember that? I sure do. Cody hit a couple shots and really was struggling. Yeah. And then we laid down the Bunker Pro, very first shot right out of the sand, yeah. actually hit it quite close to the hole. I know it was like five feet. It was night and day difference. Yeah. And I, I like improvement devices that are pretty binary. It's either okay. on or you either do it or you don't. Okay, good. And right that's here. that's what the Bunker Pro is to me. You either miss the Bunker Pro and hit the sand, you're going to hit a good shot. Yeah. Now if you hit the Bunker Pro, then you're going to struggle because that shows you're hitting either too far behind it or catching the shank protector yep. and, and hitting it where you shouldn't be on the club face. So tell me about the shank protector thing because I've never, I've never put that into a bunker concept. Yeah, well Sam, what I've found is a lot of people are hitting shanks in the sand but think that they're blading it. Oh. So I wanted something that would reveal that to them and the only thing I could come up with was the shank protector. And so that attached to the Bunker Pro has just been a deadly combination. It's been great. Mm -hmm. I mean, we've watched it. I've used it with people, and uh, there's a few shanks in there, and oh, that yeah. red rod really helps us out. So yeah. it gives them the feedback they need. We're excited. Thank you for uh, including us in the deal. Eyeline is always excited to have uh, great products with great people, which is uh, probably the first thing that I look for to start with. So we're thrilled to be a part of it. It's and, been a uh, lot of fun, Sam. It's going to be a lot of fun going forward too. Thanks, Sounds buddy. Good. You're welcome. All right, bud.